so I made a purchase a little while back. I showed a video of it and it was just kind of a, it's a word I'm trying to think of, impulse buy. This is a Lithocarpus henryi and I just planted this in my front yard here. This is a Henry's tan bark oak. It comes from uh, high elevations in China and it is an evergreen oak. Um, some people call it a large shrub or a small tree. It can get up to 30 feet and it's quite tropical looking in appearance. It gets very large leaves, uh, I think up to a foot long. And the pictures that I've, I've seen where it's flowering, um, it just gets coated with these kind of like long um, white shoots of flowers everywhere. So I actually planted this. This was not where I was planning on putting it, but where I was going to put it, there was a giant boulder under the ground because I have a couple of retaining walls. And I guess there was one of them underneath. So I looked around my yard. I don't have many places left, so I stuck it here. And uh, I think it's actually going to be a pretty good spot because um, I'm about to lose my two big street trees. And this will give me some protection from the afternoon sun because that tree and this tree are going. And uh, I kind of look up the street. Everyone stares into my house as they drive down. So this will provide me some good protection. And I think it's going to have a really nice uh, tropical looking appearance been in the pot I've been trying to water it as much as possible because it's been so dry here but uh, it's starting to put out some new growth just just uh, just starting to wake up but you can see the size of the leaf and they get bigger than this so imagine a tree and it's multi-stemmed there's probably four stems in there tree covered in these year round and these are actually quite cold tolerant uh, I've read of them being grown up in even up into New England zone 6 so my zone 8b should be no issue for this uh, plant at all and for those of you that are wondering where I got it I got it from Cistus Nursery uh, just uh, outside of Portland uh, it's on Savi Island and uh, these lithocarpus. This was the only one of the Henry I. I bought this one because it said it had the biggest leaves, but they did have, I think, edulis and a couple others. So they they specialize in a lot of um, unusual oaks, Usu more so the ones from like California, and Mexico. Um, but uh, they had this one, and I just it just kind of struck me as interesting. So we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna keep up on watering it this summer, and and I uh, hope. Uh, it forms a big tree it, it the tanks it, that they actually grow surprisingly quick so we'll see how it goes anyway thanks for watching